Hello and welcome back to another QGIS tutorial. Here I will be generating the stream network or river network using DEM digital elevation model. You can practice with the video by downloading the DEM link in the description as well. So let's get started. First, load the DEM from which we want to create a stream or river network. To add the DEM, go to layer, add layer, add raster layer and then select the DEM file you want to add and that's it. Now let's check the source of the DEM. For that right click on the DEM, go to properties and source. Here we can see that the data is in projected coordinate system. If your data is not in projected coordinate system, you should convert the DEM to the projected one before proceeding to the next step. As we have our data ready for the analysis, let's proceed our project. Now, we will be needing processing toolbox, which we can find uh, by going to view and panel and select the processing toolbox. You may have the processing toolbox by default also. Further to that, we will use Saga to fill the sync in the added DEM. To do so, navigate to Saga and Select Terrain Analysis Hydrology. Mm, then open the Fill Sync Wang and Liu. Here, this window will appear. After that, select the recently added DM from which we want to create a stream network map. Save the fill DM to the location of your choice. To do so, go here and select Save to File. And then navigate to the location where you want to save your fill DM. Enter a name and then go to save. After that, uncheck both the flow direction and the water basin because we don't want them right now. Now press run button. It could, uh, it could be a while depending on the size of the DEM. If your uh, area coverage is higher, it may take a longer time. So friend, uh, we can see the filled DEM over here. After filling the sink uh, for the stream, navigate to Saga and then go to Terrain Analysis and select Channel Network and Drainage Basins. Select the file on the elevation that is filled DEM. In threshold, I will increase the value to 7. Here, the higher value result only major streams, and the lower value uses, uh, sorry, and the lower value uses include minor stream also. You can adjust the value by trying different values unless you get the desired result. So, ex except for channel, uncheck flow direction, uncheck flow connectivity, uncheck stral order, uncheck drainage basin. Um, and uncheck junction also because we don't want any of these analysis but remember to check the channel okay so after that save the channel channel data by clicking here and then on save to file after you have found your destination location give the file a name and save it like this after that press run it may uh, it may take it, it may take some time so friend that's it uh, uh, for stream order map you can follow the link in the description uh, and to derive catchment area using dem or to create a distance from river or distance from stream map you can follow the link in the description that's all i hope you enjoyed the video for any sort of problem you can comment in the comment box Please like and share the video and please subscribe the channel for the best QGIS tutorial and lecture in special analysis. Have a good time. Happy learning.